Many of us know Bourbon Street is a place where things can get pretty wild. Yeah, but witnesses say the area reached a whole new level of crazy Saturday night during several stampede like incidents. Paul Dudley has been speaking to people who saw the chaos and has more. We're proud of the one over with the safety. Miguel Fernandez is back at work following a rather wild weekend. Here's what he said he saw Saturday night around 11 o'clock. A couple of stampedes going on. The crowd running back and forth. People getting ran over and trampled. Witnesses say they saw two stampedes, one along Bourbon near Canal and another on Canal coming from the direction of Royal Street. At least Saturday I'm working a dining, regular service. Out of the blue, just stampedes. Everyone's running, they're looking back, they're running towards Canal. The tables are getting up, they're looking like, what's going on, what's going on? Social media erupted with people reporting a shooting, but that was not the case, according to the NOPD. In fact, police say several individuals were trying to cause panic for their own amusement during a busy Bayou Classic weekend. Childish, really childish. Come on, man, we don't have a good time. You know, you're causing chaos. You can stay where you're at and do that. Known for their crowd control, NOPD officers were able to de-escalate the situation without any reported injuries. However, witnesses say they saw a handful of people with bumps and bruises and other minor injuries. The first MP was eight, the second one was three. Michael Horn was working at a Lucky Dog stand on the corner of Bourbon and Canal when the chaos broke out. He too started running. This is not good. Let me get the heck out of the way. He says he sees this kind of behavior on Bourbon from time to time, especially during big events like the Bayou Classic. He worries this kind of stuff will keep people away. It's going to bring down tourism. It's going to bring down economy in this area. It's not something you want. Now, police have not made any arrests in this particular case, but they certainly had their hands full this weekend. They tell me between Thursday night and Sunday morning, officers in the 8th District made 27 gun arrests and took 27 illegal guns off the street. Back to you. Wow. All right. Thanks very much, Paul.